Zom! Sounds an alarm if you walk away from your phone, notifying you to turn around. No more lost or forgotten phones. Zom! Notifies you of incoming calls with vibration, light, and audio alarms, and serves as a fully functional speakerphone. Zom! Helps keep you safe by sounding a panic alarm and dialing emergency assistance from anywhere in the world with just one press of a button. No monthly fees required. Zom! Zom! Boy, they're getting really creative with these product names, aren't they? What was Flabuga Flinging Dot com already taken? That surprises me, honestly. Uh, first learned about Zom and ended up getting this courtesy of Callie Lewis. Uh, when I uh, went to speak at uh, her Open Camp conference there with John Paws, uh, they created quite a conference, i got to tell you, and I was very appreciative of the opportunity uh, to go to the conference, and I was certainly appreciative to uh, play around with a ZOM. That's not how they say it, really. That's, that's how I'm choosing to say it, just because I'm trying to make this video as annoying as possible because you won't forget it at some point in the future. It'll say, what was the name of that device that did the thing where you paired it with the Bluetooth to your phone and then if you walked away from it then it rang and it alarmed. You're gonna remember it, right? That's right. Zom! Now if you sat there in your chair and you said Zom back to me, uh, you probably get bigger problems than uh, ever having lost your phone or misplaced it. Even when you're, uh, you know, around the house, you say, where did I put that dang thing? Click a button? Ah! That's where it's at. Any phone, really, that, uh, you know, is uh, compatible with uh, ZOM. Bluetooth. Oh, I love any kind of Bluetooth device. Uh, so there you go. I just read it literally off the side of the box, and that's pretty much what I was going to tell you anyway, because that's exactly what this little gadget does. Uh, I uh, did have it turned on for a little while, but um, I was afraid. Uh, <clears throat> when going through the airport, um, the last thing I wanted to have happen is me being separated from the uh, device that I had this paired to, and then going, whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> Oh, dude. Uh, you know, I'm all about going zom in videos, but it's it's another thing altogether to, uh, you know, you know start alarming everybody else with my alarms in the middle of an airport. That's one quick way to getting yourself strip-searched. Not to say that zom, you know, will do that, uh... Not to say that strip searching is bad, if you think it's okay. I mean, far be it for me if you really like being strip searched. Me, not so much. So, uh, ZOM is a piece of hardware that you may consider using if you are uh, someone who needs to keep an eye on your device, making sure you don't walk away from it if it is Bluetooth enabled. And I can't think of many devices that aren't Bluetooth enabled. Let's see here. Uh, ZOM, Bluetooth enabled. I got a... Uh, PS3 wireless headset, Bluetooth enabled. Uh, of course, I do have bamboo, and this bamboo, unfortunately, is not Bluetooth enabled. Green tooth, not Bluetooth. That's all. My email address, chris at prillo.com. More information, go.tagjag.com slash Z-O-M-M. See if I can save you a little money if you care to buy one of these things for yourself or for your family. Oh, you know, this would make a good stocking stuffer, actually, now that I think about it. It would make an excellent stocking stuffer. Who wouldn't want a Zom? Even if you didn't think you needed one. When you need one, you need one. Geeks.perillo.com, Chris.perillo.com, at Chris Perillo on Twitter. Well, I almost said Twitter.com slash Chris Perillo, but that's my Twitter profile. I was, I was kind of being redundant there all over again. Facebook.com slash Chris Perillo. Of course, we also have coupons.lockernome.com, lockernome.net, and a chat room where we are typically geeking out 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and uh, most of us happen to be tooth enabled. That's burp tooth. Just making new technologies up as I go along. Do you realize that uh, the, the name Bluetooth is, is actually... Uh, from a, a Danish king uh, who was known for uniting the tribes of, I believe it would be Denmark. It was Danish. Denmark? Uh, yeah, that's true. And the reason why he had that name Bluetooth, that wasn't his birth name, but he had, uh, let's say, a, uh, a love of blueberries, so his teeth were stained blue, Bluetooth. A Danish king that united devices. Well, no, okay, tribes.
really have devices back then. <laughs> they had tools, <laughs> but uh, I I probably uh, am the only tool you know of now. Anyway, uh, geeking out uh, at live.perillo.com. We later.